eat Indian people. Officials were scrambling yesterday to deny the veracity of a leaked report about nuclear waste spillages across our ocean floors. Sheila Hall is live. I'm at the scene. Let's hear what State Department spokesman Jim Donovan had to say. These are the kind of malicious lies and rumors that stop people from respecting their government. They are typical of the internet, which is why we are thinking of shutting it down. I mean, does anyone think it's credible that the government would lie to them about something serious? Of course nuclear power is safe, nearly as safe as oil, which is why these are the fuels we subsidize. As if nuclear waste could possibly have slipped off the deck of a tanker in a storm. The idea is ludicrous. Controversial asset-stripping venture capitalist Isaac Penny has announced his decision to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company, which is on the brink of bankruptcy. Mr. Penny has a history of desecrating companies. Wonderful. A veritable treasure trove. That's a perfectly good sock. And an entire courgette. I think you mean zucchini, Mrs. Thornhill. Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. You're not Jock Cranley, are you? Actor and artist? I love your work! Oh, stunt double? Oh, our favorite show. Mrs. Thornhill, snap! Watch the birdie! Oh, pretend to throttle me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like you did on that on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah. Oh. Uh, uh, maybe something uh, like this uh, or like uh, that, huh? You like that? Uh, that's enough, huh? dear. You like that? Oh. Oh. Uh, <laughs> oh. Hey. Oh. Oh. Thank mm, you. Wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. We are not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, We're not. not I'm, uh, I'm not Jock. Uh, what's his name? Cranley, big star in the eighties. We well, love celebs. Oh. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yes. Yeah. Before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. Oh. They're not like you or me. <laughs> Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products. Things they've actually used themselves. You guys have a great vacation, all right? I gotta go. We could do with some help. All this climbing over walls and rooting through bins. It's such a business. Nigel's got an arthritic knee. Yeah. What do you, uh, what do you need? Just a few Vinewood souvenirs for my mm. museum. No, no, look, look, look at this map. I mean, a lot of these places have famous people living in them and some that are just hanging about. Bring us some things. I'd be very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best! <laughs> <laughs> Such fun! <laughs> <laughs>
I bet I could hit your G sharp every time. You guys were amazing tonight. Ah, you know. Chin stainer is like my ultimate breakup song. That track is so fucking layered, man. It's like a Renaissance painting, buried in all the knobs and titties as are. You know what I mean? Hey, man, no more autographs. Hey, that's okay. I want something more personal. Piss off, you twat, before I kick your ass. <laughs> You're out of your fucking mind! He's trying to kill me, I'm a musical icon! I'd say my work is done here! Guess what, you crazy English fruitcake? Oh, I'm dreadful at guessing, aren't I, Mrs. Thornhill? No, she can't hear me. She's washing out a nappy from Samantha Muldoon's dustbin. Yeah, one gold tooth, courtesy of Love Fist, complete with complimentary DNA. Marvelous, marvelous. Oh, Jock, I knew you wouldn't let us down. Toodaloo!